let's get started. Alright, y'all. So today is the day that I'm finally about to paint my rims black. So I already got it all prepped. I just got a bag right around. I probably got to tie it a little bit better in the back. One last look at it before I paint it black. I'm about to take this 409 spray, wipe them and clean them down. And I'm going to show y'all as I go along, but I ain't going to record the whole process because that might be a little boring, but, but yeah, we about to get started on it. As far as I know, what I'm supposed to do is wipe them and make sure it's completely clean. And then I got to wait until everything dries and keep putting it down like a coat at a time. I'm going to try to do at least five coats. So hopefully it turned out good. If it turned out good, like the video, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And yeah, let's just get into it. But as far as I know, you really want to make sure that the rim is like completely, completely clean. So anybody who do want to plastic bit their rims, this is my first time doing it. But like, just make sure that your rims are completely clean and wiped down to dry before you start. And I feel like it's good to mask up on this part too, so you won't get the plastic that fall in your system. So yeah, I'm gonna throw this mask on. Let's get started. All right, so I just finished the first coat on all the rims. I just started off real light. I just wanted to get like a good base. That's what I'm gonna guess you gotta do. I really don't know if I'm doing it like completely correct. As long as it turned out good in the end, it's all good to me, but I'm gonna let this dry for like maybe 20 minutes. Then I'm gonna start again with the second coat. So now the second coat is completely done now. It's coming along pretty good, I think. It's coming along pretty good. But what I'm about to do is move my car forward so that I can hit maybe some corners that I didn't hit too good because I plan on putting down at least three to four more coats of it. So I'm about to move my car forward, let it dry, and then finish the rest of it. All right, so I done put down four coats so far. I'm doing all right, but the only thing that I wish I was doing a little different is not went as heavy in some areas, but like it don't look that bad, to be honest. Like, all together, the rim look good. Like you really can't tell, but until you get up close, you can kind of see spots like this spot right here. I just could have went a little lighter, but I'm gonna just keep going. I'm gonna just keep putting down as many coats as possible to try to make it look as good as I can. And I'm gonna let y'all see how it look all together in the end. I'm all wrapped up now. So I ended up putting nine coats down. I think it's pretty good. Oh. I could have did better in some spots. I might touch this spot up real quick, but I ended up putting nine coats down. I recommend anybody to do it. It's cheap. It don't cost that much money if you want your rims black. And it's something fun, a little good, a good little project for you to do yourself. All together though, I feel like it makes my car look better. I'm definitely going to change this yellow Chevy emblem. I'm going to change that to black. And I'm replacing these little lights on the front bumper too. I don't know why I ain't been did that, but that's definitely gonna change. It's ugly right there. And I got red windshield wipers. The other one coming in the mail. I thought they came in a pack of two and they didn't. So I'm slow with that. But if you like the car, give the video a thumbs up. I'm gonna just touch up a little bit of areas that I missed. 
And yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. I'll catch y'all in the next one. I'm out of here.